What made me decide to become a solicitor? It's a very, very interesting question because I come from a family of doctors, so I was the outlier. Uh, in the family, but I had a really strong sense of right and wrong and justice, and I believe very strongly in the legal system. I had a slightly unorthodox route uh, to qualification. I, I did my law degree here in the UK and then went back to Nigeria, and I did the Nigerian bar, uh, then came back to the UK, did the transfer test, and was able to reduce my two-year training contract uh, down to just six months because of some of the experience I gained in Nigeria. I worked in private practice as a corporate finance lawyer, corporate transactional lawyer. Uh, I then had my son and moved out uh, to a couple of regional firms. And then medicine was still calling out to me. So, you know, I come from a medical background and I really, really wanted to have law and medicine meet in some way. Um, so here I am. So my team is involved in a vast number of different legal areas. Uh, for example, we cover commercial law, data protection, regulatory, medicines act. But essentially our company goal is to bring innovative medicines uh, to as many patients who are eligible for them as possible. Actually getting the product out to the patient is by far our biggest challenge and my team helps and supports the strategy around that. As a team we partner uh, with our business very, very effectively. And that's really, really important. It's very important to start with the in-house lawyers because we can build up our own understanding of what the business plan might be. So it's not just about the technical uh, side of things and what you can do legally within a legal framework. It's also about actually what the business needs. It's very strategic in focus. So value is very, very different when you're working in-house because, of course, we're not generating fees. For my team, it's all about um, how can we enhance uh, the company's goals? How can we partner uh, with our colleagues to really, really help them and empower them in reaching their goals? So it's a different value proposition when you work in-house in industry, but at the same time, it's all about enhancing and helping the organisation to move forward. Ethics is very, very important to everyone in the organisation, but additional to that, of course, is, is being a solicitor and, and having all the law society's own rules to, to abide by. And integrity lies at the heart of everything we do as lawyers. I start at grassroots level, so I do a lot of work with school children. Uh, on average, I do talks to about 2,000 school children every year. Um, and I talk to them about my career path, my career journey. I talk to them about work experience opportunities as well that are available. And I try and pair people up and mentor as well. Being a solicitor is, is, at the, is everything that I do. I mean, it's such a, an important part of my life. It's all about integrity. It's all about instilling trust. It's about driving forward initiatives and helping businesses. And it means that I can do so much you know, within my career as well now, of course, you know, because being a solicitor has led to me becoming a senior business leader uh, as well. Tremendous opportunity and it's at the heart of everything I do.